Shalom. Call Hello, Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahushai, Bahashem, Rakak, Wadash, that's given all praise to the Most High. In the name of His only begotten Son, in the name of the Holy Spirit. Double honors to our teachers, the elders, and apostles, the great millstone who taught us his truth and truth and sincerity. Peace and salutations to the hopeful elect scattered abroad. My name is Ibar from the Prophets of Babylon camp down here in Tampa, Florida. Double, um, Shalom to the 144,000. Real quick, this is the book of Hebrews, chapter 10, verse 31. It is a fearful thing to fall into the hands of the living power. It is a fearful thing to fall into the hands of the living power. And as you see right here in this article from the BBC News, it says sausage dog eats woman's cheek after attack. Sausage dog eats woman's cheek after attack. So this woman, she got attacked by a dog. I'm going to read this article. Okay. She got attacked by a dog, a sausage dog, a wiener dog. You, you don't think those dogs to be really vicious. But this dog, the Lord put the spirit on that dog to do what it did. You know, and it ate her, uh, her you know, it, it bit off her cheek. Okay. And then ate it right in front of her. Okay. And this is the woman right here. You know, and that right there was the judgment of Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai. Let's go here. And especially a woman, you know, because women, women, they, they take pride in their face and their hair and, you know, all that kind of stuff. You know, their, their beauty. But she has been permanently scarred. It says Hebrews chapter 10, verse 31 in the NLT. It is a terrible thing to fall into the hands of the living power. And this is why we fear Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai, because he can have, you know, judgment come upon you in many. Well, let me say infinite amount of ways. All right. So you got to be mindful of how you. You know, moving throughout this life, you know, the things that you're doing and, you know, the way you carry yourself in this life, because hey, you never know the Lord, you know, is pissed off with you and can judge you in the mightiest way. You know, he can have, you know, which this was her friend's dog, but the Lord can have your own dog, you know, snap and, you know, chew your damn face off. All right. So let me read a little bit of this article. It says uh, Kelly Allen said she struggles to leave the house and has not gone back to work since her ordeal. It says, uh, this happened April 23rd, 2024. It says, a mother of two said her life has been ruined after being attacked by a friend's dog. Her, her life was ruined. So she all fucked up in the head. Okay, and the face. It says, Kelly Allen, or Allen, 45, from uh, 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 Swansea, uh, had part of her cheek ripped off by the tiny dash, dash, Deshun, uh, Deshund, who began eating it in front of her. So imagine a dog snaps, you know, you oh, girl, look at that cutie dog, look, 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 look at you, and that bitch snaps and tears a piece of your cheek off, and you throw it on the ground. That motherfucker start eating your part, eating your cheek up, your face up in front of you. That's terrifying. Okay, that's that's the fear of your whole body shimmer shine. That's why you know these animals, bro. You know, these animals, bro, the Yahweh Bashim Yahweh will put a spirit of vengeance upon these animals to jump on you, man. You know, say you be at work, you know, and a dog comes and, you know, uh, uh, bites you. The Lord, the Lord, the Lord allowed it. The Lord sanctioned that. You know, you might have been going off. You might have been being a nigga. You might have been, you know, talking shit, you know, in one way, form or fashion. And the Lord will have a dog or, or, or you know, it was, one, it, was, it was one video of a, of a kid. He was riding his scooter or whatever. And a bird came down. I mean, the bird came down, was pecking him in the head. I'm thinking about something else, though. It was actually a woman. She was on her phone walking down the street. And the bird came and swooped down and plucked out her eye as she was, you know, and she happened to be recording it. That was for, you know, you people to learn the fear of Yahweh Bashim Yahshai. It is a fearful thing to fall into the hands of the Lord. It says, Miss Allen needed five and a half hours of plastic surgery and more than 40 stitches to treat the open wound on her face this the the dust i don't know how to say that also known as a sausage dog was removed by police and later destroyed wow so they destroyed that little fucker and rightfully so but that was the lord that did that man you know it says and the lord it wasn't the dog fault really the lord put the spirit on the dog to do what he did for whatever for whatever reason that woman caught that judgment or maybe maybe something she did in this life maybe something she did in her past life you never know it says um 
warning this article contains images some readers may find disturbing oh wow yep there we go that's what i was looking for that's the money shot right there that's the money shot <laughs> okay let's read a little bit more it says miss allen said her self-esteem has been absolutely destroyed by the scar on her face and flashbacks from the attack yeah you start having nightmares of that situation you know she is very she said and i bet you her and the person ain't friends no, no damn more she said the very friendly dog had suddenly changed its demeanor and latched onto her face while she had been enjoying a few drinks at a friend's house right so that dog saw the spirits coming out of her she was drinking having a good time that dog saw the saw, saw the demons on her ass and latched out all right she said the very friendly dog so this is a very this is a meaning you know and those dogs aren't really vicious that, 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 that that's that, that's normally a very friendly dog you know it says the dog refused to loosen its grip until it had torn off a large cheek of her a large chunk of her cheek she said so the dog didn't want to let go it, it, uh, the, the damn wiener dog had lockjaw okay on her face the ordeal still hunts miss allen who said she regularly wakes up crying during the night and has felt unable to return to her job because of the trauma and her physical appearance. Mm. She so 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 you already know no she trying to sue. She now struggles to leave the house without being accompanied by one of her two sons, Fletcher 19 and Cooper 18. I can't get out of bed and I've been crying in my sleep because I feel his teeth in me. Wow. The Lord can do that, but the Lord can have something, you know, that seems so, you know, harmless and 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 and, and, and nice and friendly, be you know, bring hell upon you. She 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 crying herself to sleep every night. She crying in her sleep, you know. Can't even lay lay on the side of her face. <laughs> That's terrifying. She said, "I'm left with a a hideous scar on my face. It's just ruined my life because it will never be the same now." I now have to buy camouflage makeup for people who have facial dis di disfigurements. That's something I never thought I'd, I would have to do. Miss Allen says she also suffered financially as the 350 statutory sick pay she receives each month does not cover her bills and living costs. She is seeking co compensation after learning that the dog had allegedly attacked already attacked two people but she has been told the process could take years wow so this dog had, this dog had a spirit of vengeance put on it her sister stacy has launched a fundraising campaign to help her which has so far raised more than a thousand uh, uh euros i believe that is i'm a single mom oh well, look at that i'm a single mom and can't afford my electric and gas most weeks. It just seems so unfair, she said. So there you go. All right. What's his name? What's her name again? What's her name? State. What's her name? Kelly. Okay. So Kelly going through it over there. You know, she got the puppy dog face on. She feel like her life has been ruined because because of the situation that happened. And that was your whole boss, Shemel Shah, that did that, man. The Lord is, is not a joke. The Lord's not to be played with. All right, and at any moment, the Lord can have, you know, your own dog can snap and chew your damn face off, man. So fear your whole boss, Shemel Shah. And, you know, with this whole CERN shit and all these things going on in the world with the solar eclipse, the Lord is, you know, showing signs in the earth that he's about to come back with great death and destruction and, and great judgments. You see? So be mindful. Be mindful, you know. Don't be out here, you know, just, you know, going about your day, la-di-da-da, you know, get, get, getting fucking wasted and pl 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 playing in a dog face that, 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 that you know, or any dog, even if it's your own dog. And that dog snatched her, her damn cheek off. The dog tore Miss Allen's cheek and began eating it in front of her. And once a dog, see, she said it had attacked two people before. Because once a dog tastes blood, hey, man, that's it. That dog going to keep on wanting to taste that blood. You're going to have a taste for that blood. All right. So that's just an example, man. You know, that's why me personally, I don't play with animals, man. Um, You know, I love animals, but, you know, I ain't going to be, you know, sleeping with dogs and shit, bro. That shit weird. All right. But let's uh, go here. 
Hebrews chapter 10, verse 31, it is a terrible thing to fall into the hands of the living power. And that's what happened to Kelly. She fell into the hands of the living power. The Lord judged her. That was judgment. Deuteronomy chapter 32, verse 39, see now that I, even I am he, and there is no God with me. I kill and I make alive. I wound and I heal. Neither is there any that can deliver out of my hand. Right. So the Lord is the one that did that. The dog didn't do it. The little sausage dog, he didn't do it. The Lord did it. All right. The Lord did it. Let me go here. Jeremiah chapter 15. I'm going to start at verse 1. Then said Yahweh unto me, Though Moses and Samuel stood before me, yet my mind could not be toward this people. Cast them out of my sight and let them go forth. You Israelites, because you're going to continue to be niggas and, and wicked. So Lord say, I, I ain't dealing with them. And it shall come to pass if they say, if they say unto thee, whither shall we go forth? Then thou shalt tell them, thus saith Yahweh, such as for the death, such as for death to death, such as for the sword to the sword, and such as for the famine to the famine, such as for and such as for the captivity to captivity. So whatever your your judgment is, you, hey, go to that. You for see you you were you reject and forsook Yahweh Bashim Yah Shai. The Lord got a certain judgment set up for you, and there is no way around it. All right. It says, I will appoint over them four kinds, saith Yahweh, the sword to slay and dogs to tear. OK, and that dog tore a piece of her cheek off. But this is coming upon you Israelites, too, man, on another level. Esau going to come down with great wrath. He going to have these vicious canines with damn metal teeth tearing, tearing shreds off your legs and, 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 and you know, your, your arms and your back. All that stuff, man. You try to run, you know. The Lord is about to bring great death and destruction upon this place. It says, and the fowls of heaven and the beasts of the earth shall devour and destroy. And that damn dog devoured uh, uh, Kelly's cheek. All right, this is why Yahweh Bashim Yahweh is to be feared, man. All right, let's grab this and I'll close out. But this is an example of why Yahweh Bashim Yahweh is to be feared. Okay. I'll get right to the point. Ecclesiasticus or Sirach, chapter 39, verse 28, there be spirits that are created for vengeance, which in their fury lay on sore strokes. In the time of destruction, they pour out their force and appease the wrath of him that made him. And that's all that dog did. You know, the spirit that was on that dog had to appease the, the, the wrath of the Most High. She might have called a Jake a nigga. She might have passed by the camp, you know, and, and was talking shit. Or, you know, whoever, you know, anything. And the Lord thought, thought, thought it was fit to judge her in this kind of way for the whole world to see. She can't hide that. Now, everywhere she go, that's, that's going to be on her face. She's going to have to wear, 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 wear a damn shiesty mask. It says, fire and hell and famine and death, all these were created for vengeance. Teeth of wild beasts. Now, this, this, was, a, this was a beast, but it wasn't a wild beast, but it was a beast, you know, a, a domesticated beast. That motherfucker suck his teeth in her. She said she can't go to, she can't, she feel his, her teeth in her face. And death, it's like it, uh, and scorpions and serpents and the sword punishing the wicked to destruction. So that's the Lord punishing the wicked to destruction. It says, they shall rejoice in his commandment and they shall be ready upon earth when need is. And when their time is come, they shall not transgress his word. Right. And these, these, these uh, spirits are going to do the bidding. The will of Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai. No matter how cool you think you are, and how, you know, how, how nice you might dress, you know how much money you think you may have, nothing you can do to save yourself from from, from the judgment of Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai. Okay. He said, um, you know, none can deliver. All right. It's lucky. None can deliver. So, be mindful of this, man. You know, at any moment, the Lord can have a dog jump on you. A sausage dog eats woman's cheek after attack. That's terrifying, man. But that's that day. That's the spirit of Yahweh Bashim El Shai, man. Greatly to be feared, you know. Greatly to be feared. And the Lord is about to really show show this place in this world, and these people in this world, why He is greatly to be feared. And you will fear Yahweh Bashim El Shai. You got too many J Jakes and people in general just running their fucking mouth, saying all this type of crazy stuff, you know, getting proud and arrogant, thinking they that they just. Hey, they just can't be touched. Oh, the Lord about to touch you. Watch and see. Shalom. Kwame Shirala, Baba Ball, Double Honest Heart, teachers and elders and apostles, great stuff. Shalom.